What's up everyone, Jay Smith Jordan's here with another sneaker unboxing, but before we get into it, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and follow me on Instagram and Twitter at JSmithJordans. Now in front of me here, I did hit on these on the sneaker app, they dropped them early. They will be dropping these again, and they drop in December, so if you want them, there's still another chance for you to grab them. And with that said, let's go over it real quick. It looks like a Jordan 12 sneaker box, but it isn't. It has your Nike check on the top. You got your Nike branding and then on the other side you have your Nike branding and the label and it reads size 12 personal pair Air Jordan 11 retro color is black true red and white and suggested retail is 220 on these so they did give us the OG box which I do like let's open it up they did give us a card with these too here's your card if you want to read it you can read it well, there's the card now for the sneakers they did give us that trash bag plastic wrap and I do have a quality control sticker right there flip this up and there they are so let's get them out and take a look at them all right guys here they are your Jordan 11 breads my first impression on these I think Jordan brand did a great job on these this is uh, my favorite Jordan out there period it always will be I love the Jordan 11 breads that's actually what got me into uh, collecting sneakers and I think Jordan brand did a great job with this drop from the OG box to the 23 on the back you have your higher patented leather they definitely did a good job uh, it's a classic sneaker, the stitching's on point, no glue stains, so if you are going to go after this pair, make sure you do, and don't sleep because I guarantee that they will sell out the same day that they drop. With that said, let's take a look at them real quick. You got your red outsole with your hits of black, you got your jump man coming through in the middle, going to the midsole, you have your all white midsole with some hits of red coming up from the, mids from the outsole. On the inside of the midsole, you can actually see the carbon fiber plate that runs across it, which is really nice. I definitely like seeing that. Going back up to the midsole, you have your white and red midsole. And then for the upper, like I said, the patented leather, you have patented leather going up it. And then from there, on the front half of the sneaker, they have like this nylon canvas material. And then on the back, you actually have a leather right there on the heel, which is a really nice touch. They're definitely a beautiful sneaker and Jordan Brand did a great job. You have your 23 on the back of the heel. You have your patented leather. You have your jump man in red. It's just a beautiful sneaker. For the tongue, you have that nylon canvas material. And then in the middle of the tongue you have your Jordan brand running across it very clean I love the rope shoelaces that they used and all in all I just think they did a great job another thing about this Jordan is that uh, on the outside line of the leather of the patented leather it's actually white so it makes it look like a more aged sneaker more OG style which I definitely like all in all Jordan brand definitely did their thing on here and they did us right the shoes are very clean and they didn't use cheap material so make sure sure if you guys want this sneaker you go grab it it's definitely worth $220 if you ask me I will be picking up another pair if not three pairs to put in my collection and I'm glad that they dropped them and I'm glad they're in my collection with that said I hope everybody stays safe and I hope everybody's able to get their sneaker when they drop and I will see you guys on the next one